Global Investors Summit, officially the Invest Madhya Pradesh Global Investors Summit or GIS is a biennial business summit organised by Government of Madhya Pradesh in Indore, the commercial capital of central India to attract domestic and foreign investment for development of the state. Based on the theme India's Growth Centre and aimed at bringing together business leaders, investors, corporations, thought leaders, policy and opinion makers, the summit serves as a perfect platform to understand and explore business opportunities in the state of Madhya Pradesh. GIS 2007 signed 102 most worth 1.20 trillion rupees. GIS 2010 signed 107 MOS for setting up projects worth 2.35 trillion rupees. GIS 2012 signed 259 MOS for setting up projects worth 4.31 trillion rupees. GIS 2016 to 2630 investments proposed worth 5.63 trillion rupees. Topic focus sectors The primary focus sectors of the summit are agribusiness and food processing automobile and engineering defense IT, ITES and ESDM Renewable Energy Pharmaceuticals Textile Tourism Urban Development Topic GIS 2012-2014 Highlights GIS 2014 was organized from 8 to 10 October 2014 in Brilliant Convention Centre, Indore and was inaugurated by the Prime Minister of India, Sri Narendra Modi. Top names in Indian business who participated in the event were Mukesh Ambani, Anil Ambani, Cyrus Mistry, Y.C. Devishwar and Gautam Adani etc. Six countries including Canada, Australia, and South Africa were partner nations at the event. Ambassadors from 21 countries attended the summit. GIS 2012 was held in Indore from 28 to 30 October 2012 and many projects and most were signed in the three days of the summit. Of these investment plans, major investment are, setting up an air cargo hub at Indore, for which 500 hectares of land would be acquired near existing Devi Ahilyabe Holkar Airport. Reliance Anil Dhirubhai Ambani Group will enhance its integrated power plants in Madhya Pradesh at an investment of 25,000 crore rupees. Hudco to invest 2,000 crore rupees to strengthen urban water supply and urban infrastructure development schemes. M Tech Metals and Mining has inked Mo to invest 9,000 crore rupees in an integrated steel plant and an auto park to be set up in Jubalpur Division. Future Group plans to invest 2,500 crore rupees for an integrated food park and to create jobs for 21,400 people. Velour Institute of Technology plans to invest 500 crore rupees to set up a university in the state. Bharat Forge will invest 1,880 crore rupees to set up a steel plant at Shadal and auto component plants near Indore. Tata Consultancy Services will invest 410 crore rupees in Indore to create 12,000 jobs. Steel Authority of India Limited plans to invest 5,000 crore rupees in an iron plant at Chaudhurpur. STEM Learning Limited plans to invest 80 crore rupees to train 20,000 students. Rockland Hospital will invest 300 crore rupees in a super speciality hospital. NTPC has inked and Mo to invest 9,000 crore rupees to set up a 1,200 megawatts thermal power station at Cargan. American Copper Limited plans to invest 1,856 crore rupees in a 500 metric tons per annum copper plant in Balagat. Topic: GIS 2016 highlights. The Global Investors Summit 2016 was organized on 22 and 23 October at Brilliant Convention Center, Indore. On 21 October 2016, the Global CEO Conclave was held where 150 ambassadors of partner countries, CEOs of industrial groups and representatives from abroad shared dinner with the Chief Minister of Madhya Pradesh and discussed investment opportunities in the state. 
GIS 2016 was partnered by six countries the United Kingdom, UAE, Singapore, Japan and South Korea. The foundation stone for states make in Madhya Pradesh initiative was laid by Chief Minister at the event. GIS 2016 was inaugurated by Finance Minister of India, Sri Arun Jaitley. Baba Ramdev and Gopikant Hinduja attended the event for the first time. Top names in Indian business who participated in the event were Anil Ambani, Kumar Mangalam Birla. The valedictory session was presided over by Minister for External Affairs, Sushma Swaraj. Total number of most signed and total investment figures are yet to be confirmed by the government. Topic. See also Government of Madhya Pradesh Economy of Madhya Pradesh